Harry and Meghan share sweet kiss come moment and first outing since Coronation Row. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry were spotted at a Los Angeles Lakers playoff game on Monday night in a rare public appearance, and their first since the end of an explosive row over their invitation to the coronation. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry enjoyed a sweet kiss come moment on Monday night, marking their first public appearance since responding to King Charles III's coronation invite. The couple were seen laughing and smiling on the jumbotron in Los Angeles Crypto.com arena during a Lakers basketball game. At one point they appeared on the big screen, known as the Kisscom, while thousands of fans began cheering and clapping. Prince Harry appeared to lean in for a kiss before Meghan stops him by putting her hand on his arm. The Duke turns and gives the camera a joking grimace following the playful snub. The couple had lived in California since their 2020 split with the rest of the royal family. They sat in a suite in the stadium to watch the Lakers beat the Memphis Grizzlies in Game 4 of the NBA playoffs. The public appearance came hours after a beaming Meghan Markle broke cover for the first time since it was confirmed that she would not be attending King Charles's coronation. She appeared virtually at a TED event to introduce photographer and longtime friend Mason Harriman. The Duchess said she was thrilled to introduce the Nigerian-born Briton to the stage and praised his unmatched eye for a good photograph. Meghan added that he's captured many meaningful milestones for me and my family. Snaps captured by the photographer include a black-and-white photo announcing Meghan's second pregnancy and another to mark their daughter Lilibet's first birthday. Meghan also referenced his activism and his work capturing the Black Lives Matter protests. She said, his lens has captured everything from events that have changed the world, moments that we all desperately needed to see along with some of the planet's most recognizable faces. But this was not always his path, and you might be surprised to hear not who, but what, he credits for his success. Mr. Harriman thanked his friend for the introduction, and wrote on Instagram, The Duchess of Sussex was kind enough to introduce me onto the stage for my, TED Talk. Thank you for the support Meg. That appearance comes following a rare statement skewering the media for reporting on a letter sent to King Charles years ago. The Duchess reportedly sent the letter to King Charles outlining concerns she had about unconscious bias within the royal family. It followed a bombshell interview with TV superstar Oprah Winfrey. During that 2021 interview, Meghan shocked Oprah and royal watchers alike when she claimed that an unnamed member of the family had raised concerns about the color of unborn Prince Archie Harrison's skin. Meghan refused to tell Oprah who had made the comments claiming would be very damaging to the person. The Daily Telegraph reported that following the interview Meghan sent her father-in-law the letter and the paper cited an insider who claimed that the perceived unsatisfactory response by Charles was one reason the Duchess would not attend the coronation. But Meghan hit back, releasing a rare but damning statement through a spokesperson. The statement read, The Duchess of Sussex is going about her life in the present not thinking about correspondence from two years ago related to conversations from four years ago. Any suggestion otherwise is false and frankly ridiculous. We encourage tabloid media and various royal correspondents to stop the exhausting circus that they alone are creating. The statement was first released by royal author and Sussex biographer Omid Scobie on Twitter. Prince Harry will attend the coronation on May 6 alone amid strained relations between the Sussexes and the firm. Since the couple's 2021 bombshell Oprah interview, relations do not appear to have improved. Last December, Meghan and Harry released a six-part Netflix docuseries detailing their own relationship and their eventual split from the royal family. However, tensions neared a breaking point when Prince Harry released his Tell All <laughs> of the family including his brother Prince William and King Charles's wife Camilla, Queen Consort. Still, Prince Harry has said he seeks reconciliation with his father and his brother. He reportedly has spoken on the phone with the King in recent weeks which some have seen as a first step toward a date